how can I get my students more involved in the beginning of my semester besides just assigning a graded quiz? And the share links allow you to do that. So if you want to create an assignment that makes your students create a specific view, they can send it back to you and they can view what they've created and grade them on it. So we can maybe ask the students to create a view that identifies some of the facial bones. So let's go in and um, I'll select the maxilla and I'll add a tag. And we can select this nasal bone here and add another tag. And then maybe the right one as well. Now that tag. I'm just going to add a notepad that says facial bones. Okay. Put it over here. And maybe I'll add in a nice arrow because I want to just make it look really, really flashy. And good. So we'll do a nice blue arrow. And I'll point to one of the facial bones here. And now I'm going to save this view and I'm going to call it facial bones. And save it. And so now as a student, I've completed my assignment and then I can send it back to my professor via email. So if I go in here and click on the email button, I can type in my professor's email address here and send this view to them after completing my assignment. So as a professor, I can go into my email and I can copy this link. And when I go into Human Anatomy Atlas on the web, I come down to the right hand corner and click on this share links icon. I can paste the link right in this box and my students view is going to come up on my screen. So now I can go in here and I can edit any comments that they made or add my own. And then I can save the view. And I can send it back to them with my comments and any corrections that I've made. So this is one way that you can get your students involved and engaged. It's a great way to make a graded activity that's not a quiz. And it gets your students into the app, getting their hands on the models and exploring the different tools that help them learn anatomy.